So we're back on Hoi 4, going all the way up to 1940 this time, and uh, if you didn't watch last video, I suggest you do. You might get a lot of information from the previous video on to now. But if you don't want to, here's a little meme explaining what happened last video. No, please have mercy! <laughs> I do say we do prepare for a war with Slovenia. The problem with uh, being a uh, non-aligned country is the fact I have to wait till I have 50 uh, rule tension to uh, justify wars on people. So that's going to be a problem. So I'm going to hope that Germany does more uh, stupid stuff and... Uh, Hopefully starts wars and uh, causes tensions. Maybe Japan as well. I still do not know what the main issue between getting troops over here. Uh, I wasn't able to find any reason to why. So uh, yeah, I'm going to do more research later on that matter. Going to research more support equipment and better weapons, of course. Let's go ahead and get some field hospitals because those can be important for later down the line. As well as some recon companies. To start off with the good note, I have been, I am improving relationships with the British because, well, yeah. France invited us to the non-intervention committee. Uh, yeah, the terms are acceptable. And there goes Austria. Wonderful. I guess I better just, um, rework the borders here really quickly. You never know when the Germans will strike. It is good. So you gotta strike first. Well, um, okay. France? Okay, there you go, France. I, I was waiting for that. Well, uh, this is gonna be an interesting uh, year. It's 1938 and we already have a major war on our hands. Albania yields. Uh, thank you. Don't want to be the one who, uh, has to say this, but I don't really feel comfortable with Germany right now. Yeah, I get, I'm really not the only one, huh? Not really surprised Germany is going for a backup plan right about now. Who wants in our cool alliance? I honestly have a feeling that these two are just sitting there just having a good old chat. I'm going to build some land forts all across the German border and the Slovenian border. Because I don't know who's going to go where, really. This world's really messed up, but, you know, it's actually quite nice. Romania rejects German. Oh, no. Good luck, Romania. I uh, give you the best of luck. That I have a feeling Hungary is going to be part of Germany on that. Yep, and there it is. Slovenia, I think you might... Eh, you're going communist. I think you might be fine for now. You know what, France? I'll leave you alone. You're really not an issue right now. You're more of a future ally. Okay, we really do need to step up production of the military. So what I'm going to do... I cannot... Actually, I cannot because we're not fascist or communist. We are not aligned. The best ideology in the game. Actually, it's not. It's preferred ideology in the game because we all have preferred preferences and different favorites and different bests so yeah okay i got some convoys now that must mean i should be able to tr what the heck yugoslavia joins the french alliance you know honestly i think you're safe for now no you're not actually that's a problem you know the smart option would probably be aligned with germany right now but i'm not going the smart option i'm going my own option well yugoslavia it was fun german aggression is uh something the peak interest I'm, I'm not getting involved in this right now uh so we're just gonna Keep an eye on Germany and see what happens. The initial plan might be to just sit back, relax, and wait for them to use all their supplies on us and then charge in. I think that's what I might do. I think it's also the smartest play to use. So here's everyone I'm improving relationships with. But uh, can you really blame me? Let's improve workers' conditions and let's... I mean, I guess we could do war propaganda against Germany, but uh, yeah, that'd probably be awkward. I am going to try to do Promise of Peace. I'll probably keep all the troops over here. Oh, well, um... Well, we're about to have the most intense battle of the entire game. Let's spectate it. Out of the way, Italian highways. We must spectate this interesting battle. The most intense battle. Oh. But uh, yeah, I'm probably going to keep up. Are, are you... Are you kidding me? You guys are just being pushovers at this point. Romania and Chez had a backbone. At least I got Bulgaria to help me out. Problem is, whenever Germany takes up all over here in Romania, yeah, having two sides clash down on you, not really fun. Now what I could do is now I could justify a war against Slovenia. Well, a long-fought civil war has ended. With the new capital being... I'm not going to try to pronounce that. Looks like Japan is justifying a war against the uh, Union of Soviet Republics. Oh, this entire fate of Italy could come down to this final moment. They're right now distracted over here and sooner or later they'll be over here do i join france they did take down my ally well my hopeful ally yugoslavia do i team up with france and go after the germans i like also how this as soon as bulgaria you know decides to completely collapse i finally get done befriend bulgaria by the way we haven't checked up on the united states all game how are they oh my goodness no eh, let's go ahead and do some more propaganda i really do not trust germany anymore i think if i want Ethiopia to live i should not be focusing on britain and what they do what i should do and i think this might be the smartest option 
is to defend the ports. Because if Germany does decide to do their... Actually, I'm gonna... If Germany decides to do their invasion of where they attempt to invade me, I will not be able to protect Bul uh, Ethiopia if we do not have troops stationed around them. That's just me speaking now. Turkey, how are you? More troops to put to guard Rome? I will take that any day. You know, we're catching up, but... They're slowly pulling away. Uh, let's keep you just standing there and training for the time being. I have a plan for you later. 